Michael and Oswald, thank you very much indeed for joining us on the programme. I know it's a, a very busy day for you. Mm -hmm. You're here as part of Compassion Day on New Zealand's yeah. REMA mm. with, with tear funds. Mm. Now, your story is an incredible one because when you were, when you were children, yeah. um, you were in you ended up on this incredible journey heading yeah, for Kinshasa. Yeah, yeah. So, so just tell us a bit about the situation that yeah. you're in. Now we can talk about it, but mm. because we are like delivered from, from it, but it, it's, it's not a good thing. Mm. We, we were in Democratic Republic of Congo, we are Congolese, and we, we one day, just suddenly, we heard some gun, I would put some sound effects, some poo, some yeah. pew, and some guns, and it was the beginning of the, the war, war in, in Congo. So many people were, were killed, even our, in, our, in our area where we live, we, we, we used to live, and we had to leave to fly, to, to flee the, 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 the war. So we, we went we, inside Congo, trying to reach the capital city. So we had to do it by foot. One kilometer, two, ten, hundred, two hundred, one, two weeks, three weeks, six hundred kilometers, that one month after, later. Inside the jungle there, somewhere, we, find some, we found some robbers, some guys with guns. They took my money, they took the food, they took the clothes, everything we had. And they wanted to kill us also. It's just a terrible We left our family yeah. but because the boys were in a problem. They could take you by force and take you in the army fighting for the rebellion. Yeah. Or yeah. So what happened after that? We, from there we couldn't uh, continue the journey because we had no food, nothing with that. We had to turn to go back to our our town, which is 600 again. And that wasn't the end of it. One day we were sitting, eating, um, taking dinner in the evening. Some people came in the house with guns, with uh, just scary things. And they wanted us to show them some rich people in the area and to give them money and they wanted Oswald to go outside to show them houses where they can take things by force. When they left the house, I couldn't leave my, my, my brother like that. Mm. So I had to go and see what is happening outside. When I opened the door, they, I had, uh, they beat me. They, how can I explain that in English? They hit you with a, hit you with a gun, yeah. with a gun here. And I remember it took a long time to, 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 to get healed. It mm -hmm. took like two months or three wow. months. What we need to say here is uh, they killed some young people in the area. Like 15 people mm -hmm. were killed that night. And that very day my mother th said, you can't stay here in Bukavu. It's that Bukavu, Eastern Congo. You can't stay here. This is a very dangerous place for you. You have to leave. Without any money, she gave us twenty dollars. Twenty dollars that was just to help us for transport. Mm -hmm. We we left Bukavu, Costa Oswald and me, from Bukavu to Kigali, Rwanda, uh, where we found after one week on the church, we found a young a, a lady, a lady who gave us uh, a, a room, one room. Uh, three of us were together. But we thank God, our, we were just praying, fasting, praying, fasting, praying, asking God if... And singing. And singing, of course, trying to go to, to churches, singing. You can sing at a church and they give you something yeah. like five dollars. Come back home, wow, <laughs> then we can eat some beans. <laughs> so it was, life was like that for almost two years. I think God, did that in our life for a purpose, to break our pride, to make us strong. We can survive in every situation. Like Paul, Apostle Paul said, he knows to live in uh, poverty, he knows to live in... So we, we, yeah. 
we are like him. <laughs> <laughs> now, you're, you're here as part of, of Compassion Day. Yeah. How important is an organization like, like Tear Fund and, and the, the money that's raised in first oh. world countries? Oh, oh. How important is, is that? Before you finish your question, I'm already... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> if all the organization could, get, could turn themselves into tear found, even this TV tear found, all the churches tear found, <laughs> that could be great. <laughs> because we are the results of tear found. Compassion. Mm. We, my, my father died where I was two months. He was a pastor. Pastor without any business, without any, 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 anything. A land or mm. a farm. And he left my, our mom in a very bad situation. She was 34. Um, without education. So it was difficult for us to live. My mother went to contact some missionaries and they said, Compassion can sponsor only one child. So he could be sponsored and we find, we find that uh, sponsorship, we found that sponsorship of one of us. Mm. We had to choose the very lowest, the cheapest school. <laughs> public ones, very cheap, and that was our life. But compassion in our life was a very, 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 it was God visiting us. Mm -hmm. Find someone who could pay for us. That was God himself coming in our life to pay school. Because even the, the English we are talking now, we are speaking now, is the fruit of that. Even to be able to to write, to communicate, that's, that's school. So we... We thank God even for the people who were used. The person who was used to, to pay our school fees. Mm. For us, if we could see him live, if I wasn't if, as I am, I could worship him. But I can't yeah. do that. <laughs> <laughs> but it's really God himself in our life. Amazing story. It's, it's really, and he paid that. It was stopped with the war. When the war came, mm. we had to, everything was... Yeah. broken so we couldn't have connection anymore then Rwanda everything was just uh, so tier fund for us is the most important important organization because it's saving life saving life when I'm talking about tier fund now or about children in Africa or wherever wherever in the world I'm talking about my, myself. I'm not pretending. I'm, I, I can see it. I can. I know what it's, it's about. I, I, I know what the meaning of getting someone who can pay your, your school fees. Mm -hmm. That's, I, know I know the meaning of getting that person. And I know the difference between having that person and yeah. don't have that person. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's... Yeah. Mm. Well, true. thank you both very much, and, and Dave, yeah. for coming in. We look forward to your concert tonight. But it's been a privilege to meet you both. Thank you very much. Thank you. I know you.